Welcome to another edition of Inside the Film Room presented by Sharp. Bob Papa with two-time Super Bowl champion David Deal. Golden Tate, one of the new acquisitions for the Giants. And David, one of the things we're going to look at is what Golden Tate does for the Giants offensively as far as route running. The thing that you love about him is he sells his routes. He is smart and he always works back to the football. We're going to see him working right now out of the one. You're going to see him at the top of the screen. And when he sells these routes, look at the back pedal by the defensive backs. He's going to work a slant to a fake go to an out to get the first down on the key third down. So here we see at the top of the screen, he's got his eyes inside. He's very smart with his eyes, doesn't show anything. Gives a little slant, gives a little fake go, gives a little body lean push off and works his way back to the football to get that radius and a clean catch for him. You know, a lot of people talk about his size and that's being something that people don't understand that even when you do have that size, when you high point the football and work back to it with your body lean the way that he does, that's how he makes up for it. He's a guy that has return history in his background as well, and he's really good with the football in his hands when he's got to make people miss. You know, before this last season where it was split between the Lions and Eagles, he had four straight seasons of 90-plus catches. And during those four straight seasons, he led the NFL in yards after catch. You can see him get after plays and finish plays. That's what you love about the toughness of him as a player. So on this play to demonstrate those yards after catch, we're going to watch him work out of the slot here. And the thing that you love about him is once again, finishing the plays downfield. You see him that work the out, then works the up, sees the quarterback is under duress, but what does he do? He finishes his route and look at his explosiveness in the open field, working hands off, working bodies off, and he will fight and get that extra yard you need. But the thing that you love while he does that, he always protects the football. Now, he's got a lot of years in the National Football League. He's got a great understanding, a high football IQ of what to do when things break down. And that's what you have to do when you have a veteran wide receiver like Golden Tate and you have that scramble drill where you have to have that improvisation. Once again, working out of the slot. And what is he going to do? He's going to find a way to get himself open in the back of the end zone. You see Carson Wentz gets the football. They're down working in the red zone. Doesn't have time, there's a little bit of a coverage. He's scrambling, but what does Golden Tate still do? Works in the back of the end zone, finds that opening to make sure that he has that cohesiveness with the quarterback. Obviously, we talked about Golden Tate's versatility, and you know, not only can you throw it to him, you can give it to him. One of the things that opens up the running game for everybody is misdirection and deception to make that defense hesitate for one split second. Now, we're gonna see Golden Tate once again out of the slot, but what are they going to do? They're going to run a little reverse with him. See him motion down inside like he normally has always. Gets the little motion, and boom. That little bit, that little bit of open field and action gets the defense a split-second hesitation. And once again, on a first down, they're now in a second and one. That's what you want on the offensive side of the ball. And that's something that we saw incorporated in the Pat Shermer's offense a lot more last year. That's a look at Golden Tate inside the film room presented by Sharp.